It is expected that three main iterations will be needed to achieve a highly perfected version of the Tesla Optimus humanoid robot. Elon Musk stated as much in the most recent episode of the All In podcast. As a result, you should anticipate that in large quantities. Additionally, I believe that three production versions of Optimus are likely required. Therefore, the design must be improved at least three times before production is scaled up to produce more than a million units annually. And at that time, I believe the labor and material cost on Optimus is probably not going to be much higher than $10,000. In 2025, Tesla intends to produce a restricted quantity of Optimus robots, which will become more widely accessible in 2026. In five to six years, he hopes to have the robot produced at a rate of 1 million units annually, at scale volume using three significant technological developments. Therefore, if a modest car costs $25,000, an Optimus, a humanoid robot that can be your friend, and is perhaps even more superior than R2-D2 and C-3PO would probably cost about $20,000. In all honesty, I believe that people will grow really connected to their humanoid robots because, well, if you sort of watch Star Wars, you'll see that characters like R2-D2 and C-3PO are great. I mean, they're really great. Furthermore, given their demeanor, R2 could only be cruel to you. He said that the upcoming version will feature significantly enhanced hand designs that are closer to human capabilities. There are now 11 degrees of freedom in the Tesla bot's hand design. Its fingers and thumbs can move in many directions, but not as much as a human hand, which has roughly 25 degrees of freedom. The actuators, which are responsible for movement, are located inside the hand itself. This setup makes the hand bulkier and less agile reducing its ability to perform delicate tasks that require precise control and adaptability. The current Optimus hand can grip and manipulate delicate objects, but cannot yet handle complex tasks requiring a high level of dexterity like threading a needle or playing a banjo. Tesla is pushing the AI robot toward production as a growing array of companies race to corner the humanoid robot market. In the US, it's up against the likes of the Figure 2 Agility Robotics Digit Boston Dynamics Atlas and Sanctuary Eyes Phoenix. One X is also generating buzz with its Neo Robot, which the startup hopes to mass produce in the next few years. And I think this is going to be probably the most exciting time ever in history to be alive. And I'm so glad to be part of this. And I think we have a possibility here to solve so many societal problems. There's also an onslaught of advanced AI robots emerging from China including the Fourier GR1 and GR2, the Xbang PX5, the Xiaomi Cyberome, and Unetrix H1 and G1. The number of robots on the planet versus humans. Yeah, I think the number of robots will vastly exceed the number of humans. Vastly, yeah. I mean, you have to say, who would not want their robot buddy? Everyone wants a robot buddy. Musk also said he sees the robot playing a key role with future Mars colonization efforts. Musk also recently said he envisions the Optimus eventually integrating with Neuralink. Yes, you could communicate with Optimus. Yep, absolutely. Elon Musk envisions a future where physically handicapped people's abilities could surpass the able-bodied. If you take parts of the Optimus humanoid robot and you combine that with a Neuralink, let's say somebody has lost their arms or legs, well, we could actually attach an Optimus arm or Optimus legs and do a Neuralink implant so that the motor commands from your brain that would go to your biological arms now go to your robot arms or robot legs. And again, you'd have basically cybernetic superpowers. That's what he said during Neuralink's latest update when discussing future integrations between Neuralink and Tesla's Optimus humanoid robot. He said Neuralink patients could give commands simply by thinking that would enable even those who can't speak or move to control Optimus through the brain-computer interface. In the future, he said, Patients could have robotic arms or legs connected to Neuralink controlled by the brain. Neuralink recently announced it had completed its second successful transplant. The patient, a quadriplegic named Alex, successfully used the brain-computer interface to control digital devices with his mind. He could move a computer cursor, play video games, and even design 3D CAD objects using Autodesk 360 Fusion. Neuralink said that the testing shows their brain-computer interface could enable people with limited mobility to perform complex tasks using just their brain signals. On X, Elon Musk said he hopes to have Neuralinks installed in hundreds of people in the next few years. If all goes well, he said, millions of people could have the brain chips in a decade. 
Musk also envisions a future where humans could upload their minds into robots, enabling them to continue existing in some form after death. Musk made the prediction on his X platform, responding to a post asking, would you copy your brain into an Optimus to live longer after your physical body die? He said eventually humans will likely be able to upload a good approximation of their memories and mind states into the cloud. The digital twin could then be used to power the humanoid robot. He said, obviously you won't be quite the same as you are today. What futurist Ray Kurzweil believes will occur by the 2040s is comparable to the vision. According to the author of The Singularity is Near, human consciousness may be successfully stored to enable digital immortality when humans transcend biology. Entire brain scans would record every connection that forms memories and thoughts. The mind would then continue operating digitally after that info was uploaded to a computer. The complexity of human awareness and the mind, according to critics, are too great for any technology, present or future, to fully comprehend. At Tesla's 2021 A Day, Elon Musk revealed a humanoid robot called the Tesla Optimus. Optimus, often referred to as Tesla Bot, is designed to perform jobs that would be hazardous, tedious, or repetitious for a human. Its progress is continuously monitored. As of July 2024, Tesla intends to produce the robot in small batches for internal usage in 2025 and make it available to other businesses in 2026. Musk has great expectations for Optimus, projecting that it will eventually raise Tesla's valuation to $25 trillion on the stock market. I predict that everyone on the planet will desire one. I believe we could produce one for perhaps $10,000, which is extremely pricey. Since it's smaller, it would cost less than an automobile. From that, Tesla would essentially profit by a trillion dollars annually. Thus, yes. Standing around 5 foot 8 and weighing 125 pounds, Optimus features advanced AI and automation tech developed by Tesla for their electric vehicles. Tesla plans to incorporate its full self-driving computer into the Tesla bot, adapted for bipedal locomotion and task execution. In 2024, a small number of Optimus robots started working in Tesla's factory. Remember to subscribe to stay hip on the latest in humanoid robotics. Leave suggestions for humanoid robots to include in future roundups in the comments. As we look ahead to a future where 1 million Tesla Optimus robots could become a reality, the possibilities are both exciting and revolutionary. Elon Musk's vision for the Tesla bot is more than just a technological milestone. It's the beginning of a new era where humanoid robots assist in everyday life and reshape industries. Whether it's in manufacturing, healthcare, or even in our homes, the potential impact is massive. If you're excited about the future of AI and robotics, be sure to subscribe for more updates on groundbreaking innovations from Tesla and beyond. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for what's next in the world of technology.